Hey what's going on everybody, welcome back to another video, this is Ben and this is a RTM tool review. This is of Quizzles, I think it's pronounced, RTM tool for, well it does a majority of games, there's Black Ops 2, Black Ops 3, MW2 and Advanced Warfare and it has some other different features in it as well. It's got an Xbox mods which just change your X notify me and your gamer tag. Uh, you got an IP puller and you got another section which actually does your um, gamer tag as well. You can choose what game you're in, etc., and you can change it all. So you got different options there. But anyways, getting back into it, this review is actually just on Black Ops 3. I'll probably get around to reviewing Black Ops 2 and MW2 and Advanced Warfare uh, with this actual RTM tool and see how well it actually is. But anyway, for the Black Ops 3, you ain't got many options, but it's not too bad because you know I say they're reasonable. So I've used this menu a few times. Um, it's, it's okay for certain things, which I'm about to get into now. So as you started off in the video, you probably saw that I did straight away, I did a prestige. Um, I tried out to make sure it works. It actually, when you open up this menu, like this RTM tool, it comes up with like a set already prestige 11, level XP, score, kills, death, wins and losses already set up for you. You can still change them around, they're very customable. Uh, customizable you can do whatever you want you can change your prestige level and how much XP and everything you can do all of that I just thought I'd have a go whatever they set it as I just want to see if it actually changes actually sets and actually works um, for that part it wasn't actually too bad it actually did quite quick the only bit I was not too um, I don't know really I was happy with it it could have been a little bit faster was to unlock most it took a little while for it to set all my max guns all attachments and everything like that but apart from that, it wasn't too bad on that side. If you were looking for a um, tool to do recovery lobbies, prestige, etc. like that, this tool is pretty well good for you. You can use it for that. Um, then I tried to get online. Ignore the fact that I couldn't get into a game straight away. My connection isn't that very great at the moment. But once I got into a game, I find it's got a lot out a few times with this um, RTM tool. Uh, rib boxes and UAV actually do work. I have used them before with this RTM tool um, but I'm not 100% sure if I came up in this video if they actually showed you that because straight away after that I clicked wall run where I looked at the ground and I actually couldn't move it at all um, which ended up freezing my Xbox I had to actually turn it off and on again I have found out this RTM tool is very buggy to use sometimes if you use loads of options um, that was the first time I ever used wall run so I avoid if you use this RTM tool it might work for you so you can try it but I would try and avoid using the wall run um, never actually got to experience that, sadly enough. But apart from that, it's not a bad menu. You can't take a loads of um, an overload of different things. You can't tell it to do this, that, this, and it will freeze your voice. You have to do, just do one command at a time, and it will work. Um, apart from that, the background, mm, it's okay. It could have been changed around. All the colours sort of clash together with the green of the background for like the text with the prestige level score, and that is. Um, the top where it's got all the game selections, that sort of, it's hard, not hard to see, but you sort of have to look at it a couple of times to actually see what it is. Um, but apart from that, it's not a bad menu. If you're looking for an RTM tool to do recoveries, etc., I definitely recommend this as one of them you might want to try out and use. So anyway guys, I hope you enjoyed the rest of the video or whatever else it is. I'm not how sure how far it's going to be ending as I recorded this uh, clip of audio separately. But anyway guys, I hope you're all having a good day and I'll see you in the next video guys.